for the year, our facility was full most of the year. We do not have a waiting list, but we have women constantly, daily, seeking housing. In 2010, almost 3,000 women went to the YWCA looking for a home. Unfortunately, some of them were turned away due to lack of resources. Tonight, hundreds of Calgarians will sign up to be homeless for the night. We turn the gym into the equivalent of a shelter. Um, the participants line up outside with their sleeping bags and pillows. Um, and they come into the gym, they get a soup supper, uh, they, we provide a mat for them. The experience is meant to emulate what it would be like to be homeless, from waiting in line outside the YWCA, to the worn out gym floor, to the dingy mats to sleep on. The experience could be a jolt into the reality of homelessness for some. About 60% of the women we serve has some point in their lifetime sustained spousal abuse. But our program is not just for women who have experienced spousal abuse or who are fleeing violence. Our program is for any woman who's homeless. Recently, the YWCA received a generous grant from the Home Builders Association in order to help provide 14 new beds in the YWCA for women and children. In the meantime, come Friday night, people are going to be sleeping on the floor of this gym in hopes to provide more support for these women and children around Calgary. For St. News File, I'm Rochelle Scott.